Yo, 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 lucky noob is back with this bitch and I'm uh, casting Terran versus Protoss Brood War replay on the map. What is the map? Um, hmm. Yes, Fighting Spirit, of course. Fighting Spirit 1.3, I believe. And... Uh, what are those things, by the way? I think they are uh, bones. They do look like bones, but they're not Ursadon or other Kakaru bones because there are no such critters on this map, as far as I remember. And building this flight depot here, that is very smart. Now the SCVs pop from closer, a bit closer to the minerals. There you go. And uh, uh, this is Lee Sky versus Tiger. Arr. He's not a pirate, he's a tiger. Could be a pirate tiger, tiger pirate. So orange is tiger and Lee, uh, Lee Sky. Should I call him Sky or should I call him Lee? Well, if he goes ground army, I call him Lee which he probably will and if he goes uh, battle cruisers I will call him Sky because Sky is cooler much cooler name I think and the probe is the what? whoa dude wait a second what are you doing tiger you idiot oh no tiger thought that he saw the SCV here and he thought that uh, uh, the Terran has just scouted that location, so he supposed that Terran is not here. He mind out mind gamed himself, his stupid tiger. <laughs> and now he he scouted this base, scouted this location, and now scouted this. So this will be a very late scout, and the Marines will deny it absolutely positively denied and the scv will be denied by the goon so it's uh oh no how did you do that you stupid tiger you're an idiot oh why did you let the scv in he saw the spinning cybernetic score not too big of a deal but why did you move the dragoon just for one scv that's in ah oh. and now plopping down warping opening warp rift for the nexus it's i never understood why the warp rift is just as big as the pylon for the nexus and the other uh Terran, i mean the other protoss buildings and oh that probe got owned by this yes this marine private and uh the Terran will be expanding as well producing first tank uh, the searching sea soon, I assume. The dragoons are not poking. Maybe he's waiting for a third one to poke this. There are only four marines. If he pokes with the right micro, which he, uh, yeah, which he doesn't, he's not capable of. I don't believe, but shall see if. He could be, he could do some damage. Well, not now. Should be able to snipe the tank. That's very important. If the first tank being sniped or not. Oh, he's going here. Nice. We will siege uh, in uh, five, four, three, two, one. Siege now. There you go, thank you so much. And now the Dragoons will go just as the siege is ready. Great, great play by Tiger. Oh, uh, and Terran is scouting for the third base. I believe he doesn't see it here, it could be here in other, other places. And will the SCV get intercepted, interfaced, inter raped? Yes, it will. There you go. In the oh, don't let it thank you. We did see the natural expansion, so uh, there will be no 
Well, robotics facility going down in the observatory. So we will see river. I mean robotic support bay. Uh, is it a bay? What facility? I think it is a bay. A bay. Robotic support only. And uh, just in the first river. And probably we would a dragoon as well won't wait for the other river we have one turret here one here mm, and a turret in the net in the main base no no protection in the main base though but he has this this army is uh, here in this tank yeah that will be enough to fend off any goon play and any other trying uh, run by some stuff but going down only one tank here uh, it will be very curious to see how much damage will the river do and the protoss will be taking his third base immediately during or even before the harassment starts mm. walling off with pylons always lovely to do one dragoon instead of a cannon i like that i really like that but he will yeah he will go for the forge in the cannon as well and the shadow the slow slow shadow is uh, passing over the trees and the weird uh, what do you call them artifacts no oh no don't die to the oh nice he saves it not even a shot but the terran probably knows about it by now oh what am i pressing and he will go around the terran will terran is not he's producing what is he producing producing tanks should be macroing yeah there you go it's macroing better now uh will probably go for his third base as well because why not and there it is shadow i mean a uh, turret one shot at the shadow drop the river the oh killing three or four or two scvs not bad getting a little bit of damage a bit of covering uh a little bit of rainbow stuff on uh, the river and the observer run into the turret but didn't die that's good as well so the protoss will know about those uh, vouchers coming out to uh, to do some harassment of this third base and possibly lay mines of fourth base producing probes as he should and even yeah good should actually have the dragoons here it's better so they don't run by but he has a cannon as well there you go now they won't they won't run by and he will put some mines here as well and should put mines on every expansion and oh the shadow is trying again yeah this turret has not disappeared there it's still there in the engineering bay uh should actually be over this turret so it's hidden that's what most people do and we got 103 supply for the protoss versus 91 for the terran so pretty pretty even game the protoss should uh go for yeah we'll try to deny the third base and the terran realizes that so he will try to pincer the protoss getting the mines laid down the base will be denied there you go the knight oh and tiger blood oh yes i was waiting to make that joke blue tiger blood <laughs> from the tiger protoss and oh more tiger blood <laughs> getting dragoons fucked getting four dragoons and the vouchers can actually they can actually kill the dragons i think that's only five but he will protect them with the other dragon in the river and this 
deploy some vouchers. Losing another dragoon. The tanks are pushing from the up, from the from the up, upwards. From the middle expansion, the tanks are pushing a one dragoon left in the river, and the observer following. Follow the Terran army, not your own army at the moment. Well, probably has another. What is this? Oh, there we go. The mines. Uh, should have another observer ready. And is he going for arbiter play? Yeah, probably will be going for arbiter play or even some Corsair Dematrix action. And the Terran is taking the middle and oh, nice one raid to hunt down the shadow. That is, I like that. I always like that because you, uh, you have to make the. Uh, starport anyway for detection for the and oh the protoss just went around and going for the natural of the this tank is not here anymore and oh the river put down the river and kill the SCVs the river use the river dude use the river don't don't use the river on the SCVs Use the river on the SCVs. What are you doing with that river? And ah, oh, you will die to the shadow. You will die. Oh no, don't lose the river. The river dies inside the shadow ungloriously, and Tiger destroyed himself there. All the blue black is soaked into the ten the lost no the fighting spirit and the problem is yeah mine the problem is tiger has the spirit but i don't think he has the brains that much or not yet at least uh, come on dude pick it up and there you go temple archives finally finally producing a temple archives and this base is not going down anytime soon i don't believe repair if he repairs you need more repair actually i think yeah there you go two SCV. oh no this will go down oh it would have gone down if it didn't stop what are you doing dude oh tiger you're doing the wrong things and now the tanks will destroy you and oh the mines the mines the mines killing the tanks and the zealots and oh nice he will destroy this army oh there you go nice well done finally from tiger he created uh, armies there and he's ahead of supply 20 supply ahead that is very nice well done from tiger finally doing something right in this game in my opinion and uh, getting a force base as well that is good and the Terran it will be funny if the Terran takes this base and then he just produces a tank and the Dragoon is being uh, uh, what the Dragoon is produced by the Protoss here if he puts gateways and he just meet here and say hello hi I got a base downstairs. Do you have a base upstairs? Yes, I do have a base upstairs. And now you die. The tank will stay in the tank will win because tanks. One tank with one dragoon is no match for the dragoon. And uh, still not upgrading. Dude, upgrade please. Upgrades. You need the upgrades. Otherwise, you will get absolutely. Mm, turn into blue oh and just putting down the an ice putting down the expansion and the protoss goes there and <laughs> tiger cancels i mean uh, the lee cancels the expansion the second the protoss was there that was a very fast response it means lee is looking into the game uh paying attention to everything i mean and tiger what are you doing macroing and he is researching his upgrades so that is very nice very good one one already not bad not bad at all and the observer sees the moving out of the oh and storm storm but losing why height one high templar uh don't lose the high templars they are very important units for your army 
as I'm sure you well know, Tiger R, R, Pirate Tiger R. And uh, laying more mines. Where are the arbiters being produced right now? And another starboard. Good. Good, good, good. This is uh, going to be a very large macro game. And oh, this, this corner of the map is being claimed by the Terran. Those tanks are not going down anytime soon. Unless he recalls, drops zealots or storms there. Yeah, he cleared all the mines because the mines were put out. So they will die needlessly. Yeah. All the mines here because they were too far away. That is not. I should not put them there. They should have been here in range, in reach. The tanks and oh, the Protoss is attacking. More useless mines being put down. They're just slowing down the Protoss. There are only four tanks here, but more tanks behind. And the first science, oh no, the second science vessel is out. He's not using it yet. Um, engaging, uh, just poking about around. Oh, oh. Clearing, very good job of clearing the minefields by the oh and just as I say that he gets hit by three mines ah makes me eat my ass I hate eating my ass sucks and those observers the protoss seen everything the Terran is doing nothing out of the ordinary as well but and the oh I would love a storm to be dropped here this is not good actually transferring without any help all the SCVs to the expansion and queuing up five SCVs why not who cares and uh, more turrets yeah so nothing gets dropped here and probably put some turrets on this side as well denying the just watching out for another expansion you don't want to leave the term with too much expansions and expanding here himself tiger is uh, transferring probes a lot of probe production almost maxed out Terran is almost maxed out so just one supply needs to produce one more scv and yeah there you go it's maxed out and protoss yeah, he has three. It's losing. Oh, and Storm! Oh, he lost another High Templar. And, oh, fuck. There probably was two High Templars there. That is not. You need to protect your High Templars. You will need that Storm because the Terran is preparing the push, the four kill High Templar, and all that. And the Arbiters gathering energy for stasis recalls and all kinds of good good stuff they will be doing to the <laughs> terran to lee to yellow lee lee yellow who is pushing the uh, one four space of the uh, Protoss and the Protoss must know about it now he knows and even building a factory inside the oh and loses a tank to the cannons that was lame even building a factory inside the base that is uh, so late game harass so late game rush and splitting his army ah uh, come on tiger impress me now bitch Impress me now. There are no only one Goliath. The, oh, the cannon. There are no. Oh, nice stasis. Not a lot of tanks here. So this will probably get cleared out. There you go. Those two tanks will die. Everything. The vultures will fall down. The Goliath. There are the other Goliaths. They should focus the Arbiter. There you go. Focusing the Arbiter. Losing one Arbiter. The Storm. Storm, nice. And oh, focus, focus the Templars. Not focusing the Templars, trying to be and cancelling the stupid 
factory there and all of these tanks are raking up some kills but he's producing from here as well so yeah reinforcements even a dark templar which is desperate move usually and oh the vultures massacred all the probes here nine kills five kills and four kills of these vultures hero hero vultures denying a lot of mining time while expanding and producing more factories himself and trying to expand here again and again the protoss is on top of that attacking the command center the command center will try to fly away will he try to save it yes some vultures coming it will not it will go down repairing with the scv the vultures laying mines and goes down but the goons will die to the mines ah, oh no goons dying to the mines and will he go for the another command center no first he got i think saw the dt is making a turret here two dts not too big of a deal yet i would like him to crush this place and mind control this uh scv and build some tanks of his own that will be awesome awesome but he won't do that because he's boring tiger come on go with the probes mine at your uh, this oh it just got taken out yeah you should retake that as well because the terrorists are more bases than you and oh no the mines oh, tiger blood and uh, yeah anticipating where the terran will be and where the terran will expand a very nice a very good star sense might i say and yeah there you go with the observer seeing the wall of going down now this is this is how you actually expand as a terran you build your wall of first you put some forces oh yeah it's not a tight wall <laughs> He can just walk in and he does. There you go, crushing this little batch. Not being cancelled, he will lose all those minerals. Yeah, doesn't matter really because he has too much anyway. Maxed out Terran versus a maxed out Protoss. And Protoss is, I mean, the Terran is pushing once to deny the base again. This time with a lot of tanks, but not so many vouchers. This is the the hardest thing for a Terran is to find the perfect mix that he needs in order to counter what the plot is doing. And oh, the storm! The storm taking out tanks. More storm! More tanks being taken out. More storm! Oh, the tanks falling down, and the Protoss will crush absolutely crush this terran push kill the science vessels losing one save save the other science vessel and yeah he did emp so that was good and even taking and denying this base again all oh, these bases oh, and this zero drugs the mine uh, yeah kill the tanks and oh he's trying to yeah he won't be able to save it goliath's going back one time oh more tiger blood from tiger the bloody tiger the bloody protos tiger the bloody protos and yeah this this is being he really wants another base <laughs> even though he doesn't really need it at the moment although he will run out of minerals eventually he's on three bases and Protoss is on three base, but not really saturating this base or this base or any base for that matter. And not using his probes. This is I wanna smack him for this. This is two, four, six, eight, uh, ten, twelve, fourteen. Too many, way too many idle probes, dude. Use your probes. Finally transferring some. There you go. Thank you. Thank you for listening to me ah oh, finally you should listen dude and oh the tribune more tiger blue blood 
and will he try the Rico in this base that is the only option he has for taking it at this point in the game watch out for this arbiter in the minimap I shall he's been moving somewhere uh, he's gathering there you go he's gathering the forces he will go for it there you go only one turret and one oh will he lose the arbiter don't lose the arbiter he will lose the arbiter storm yeah this is one arbiter but he does recall and does oh why are you storming on the turrets that does not work never storm on the turret probably somehow oh, some SCVs there good uh no there were no SCVs because he had no kills and zero no kills only those two SCVs will be here and Protoss will put a pylon instead says yeah I take this base for myself but the Terran at the same time he's counter-attacking again at this position and only one Arbiter and he can stasis the ramp he should stasis this ramp although oh storm more storm clumped up tanks dying the more storm oh damn the storm destroy oh here it is the hero the hero uh the hero high temper taking another four tanks and uh, giving the chance of the rest of the army to come here and again crushing the army of the Terran with storms those storms have done some massive damage but now taking all the high templars this is not good uh, crushing the army again very impressive from the protos very impressive crushes of the Terran army and don't lose those high templars please you can produce more so you don't have too much gas to spend it. Yeah, dude, where are you going? Go to the tanks. Where are you going? Oh, you idiot. Oh, he stop. Ah, he loses a high templar. He lost a high templar to three stasis tanks. That's not, not how you do it, dude. And oh, losing the pylon as well. Another three tanks being sent here. A ragtag squad. And losing the salad. Losing the dragoon losing another dragoon and will not be losing this dragoon yet oh, oh don't leave the arbiter as well please please mike with the arbiter away thank you and yeah there you go good destroy the turret in turn although he's muckering like a beast that's the problem here he has a new army ready and science facility floating about if the proto snipe the science facility Terran will be left with no detection no mobile detection which will be troublesome and oh, losing those zealots storm useless storming his own observer more than anything and vouchers destroying cannons there is not something you see every day there you go the tanks are out of position they are not the vouchers should go back and protect the tanks because those tanks will be crushed again by the protos and there you go stasis on three scans it doesn't even yeah because the oh and more storm taking more tanks there you go crushing the tank uh, getting the tank count down again but losing all the probes is usual. He's used to using, using those probes. And even D Matrix Goliath on the ramp, that is gay. And everything focuses the D Matrix. There you go. And we'll lose another Arbiter. Oh, Storm. Storm. No Storm. And don't produce Dark Templars, please. And this little, little army here. Uh, Four, five, uh, four, five of everything. Three tanks, three Goliaths, and five vouchers. We will take out the rest of this, and uh, that will be it. That will be game because the Protoss is just now taking this base. And oh no, recall will be happening there. 
is now taking this base and is at 80 supply while the Terran is at 194 supply so it has been a good game the problem with us the Terran macro was too strong even though his uh, he in when he engaged he always lost his entire army that's the problem but he could and he did rebuild it very fast afterwards so and more lag oh my god i hate lag i hate lag why is lag happening i don't understand this i don't understand it there you go and finish the game already you fuckers there you go, the Arbiter's moving out, Stasis, everything, there you go, but no army to kill everything, ah, Storm, Storm, and oh, yeah, Terran tanks killing everything, GG, Lee wins, Lee Sky wins, and Tiger Max, you're good, uh, what's your max rank, Tiger says, and Lee, uh, hey, D, <laughs> Yeah, sure, D. Me? Yes, you. Yes, you. Uh, yes, you. What is your rank? Four years ago, C plus. Yeah, C plus. That is C plus. B B minus even. Nice. I would not have expected. It's probably not that old of a game. I'm guessing. C plus is C and C plus is about right what he played this game and GG until next game.